Hello friends, in the last session we saw some important docker concepts like pulling the docker image from the docker hub, running the docker image as a docker container and then accessing that docker container from the browser. And friends, there we saw that the URL we have to use to access the docker container from the browser should have IP as 192.168.99.100. So let us try to understand the reason for the same. So friends, I am working on my laptop which we can also say as host machine and we can access this machine using localhost or 127.0.0.1 and on the top of this host machine we install docker toolbox and friends docker toolbox comes with toolkit of softwares and one of the software is oracle virtual box and oracle virtual box is a software with the help of which virtual machines can be created on the top of host machine so friends, when we start docker quick start terminal, docker toolbox creates one virtual machine named default with the help of this oracle virtual box. And this machine is known as guest machine. And the default IP of this machine is 192.168.99.100. And then whatever operations we are performing on docker quick start terminals, like starting the docker container, stopping the docker container, pulling the image, happens in this virtual machine. So friends, when we started two docker containers which are nginx and tomcat, they got started inside this virtual machine. And friends, this is the reason why we are using IP as 192.168.99.100 to access the docker containers from the browser. And now for the people who are running docker containers directly on their host machines, they can use IP as localhost or 127.0.0.1 to access the docker containers from the browser. Also friends here I would like to show you the command to list down all the virtual machines running inside the docker toolbox. So let us go to the docker quick start terminal. And the command is docker hyphen machine ls. This will list down all the virtual machines running inside the docker container. As you can see right now there is one virtual machine whose name is default which is in running state and the URL of this machine is 192.168.99.100 the same which we used in the browser to access the docker container. So friends with this I am stopping this session over here. We will see the explanation of how hyphen p option helped us to access the docker container from outside world in the next session.